Hello traders, today is the 19th of February, Wednesday 2020 and I would like to share with you today's best forex trade analysis. Just before the analysis, I want to show you that uh, I have personally accumulated 183 pips based on that live intraday analysis with the live audio crack support. It was an amazing day today. We had a, such a beautiful trades today. As you can see, the breakdown of all of my trades only, I think I have only had three losing trades. Apart from that, we had a, such a beautiful day today. The best um, trade was my dollar yen. And that is the 66 pips. You can see it. That was basically, we had it um, this um, breakout at the Asian session. And then we mentioned to look for another uh pull back as you can see the price went up came down and respected and this level here where we mentioned through live rd commentary and i took a sh long trade in this one and banked some profit beautiful uh long trade on dollar yen and i also banked a couple of good pips on small you can see this was a pretty straightforward as you can see the pullback that's my entry that's my exit and all these trades are 100% based on the analysis which is broadcasted here. As you can see, 18 targets, basically, um, best analysis we had it today. And all of them, you know, banking some pips. Uh, even if you if you look at any pairs, like let's suppose if you look at in pound dollar, this was the breakout trade here as a pullback, as mentioned exactly on the analysis one two three beautiful because all of these trade basically we communicate live uh, with all of our members through live our documentary that's why it's a real game it's a real trading environment all right let's move to the analysis okay so just to recap all these are intraday analysis uh with the live our documentary as you can see uh, on the left hand side is the analysis, the right side is a trade taken based on the analysis. We were expecting a consolidation breakout on dollar yen, but based on the momentum, we had a beautiful long trade. This was the trade, uh, this analysis was from yesterday, and we had a breakout uh, just before the Asian, you know, European session opened. And as mentioned, that we had it another a long trade, as mentioned with another analysis, and I took a long trade, beautiful breakout long trade on dollar yen uh pound yen pretty straightforward we had this breakout and after the breakout we have another beautiful long pullback long trade on pound yen a euro pound pretty straightforward uh this one again as a breakout long trade and the kiwi dollar pretty straightforward this was the another small consolidation um, breakout we had only few pips to manage squeeze on kiwi dollar uh, pound says Frank pretty straightforward. This was the trade just before the news release for CPI news release for the cable and we banked some profit as soon as the price hit to the first target uh, just before the news as you can see the news was 930 at 920 we mentioned guys to you know tight your stop loss or bank your profit uh, because we are not you don't trade a uh, news we trade the uh, reaction of the news okay pound dollar pretty straightforward as mentioned on the analysis we were expecting a pullback short as mentioned here as you can see it price nicely develop a pullback and also is a wedge breakout and based on the momentum beautiful nicely price hit to the first target beautiful short trade i personally manage a couple of good pips on this trade too dollar again as mentioned on the analysis uh, guys, this is the first trade. I bank it. I hold that trade. And we always communicate with our traders just in case if you miss the first entry, you will find another fine entry if you want to join that trade. Uh, so we had, a, you know, two beautiful entries on dollar yen after the breakout. Uh, pound says, Frank, pretty straightforward. You can see this was the breakout. That's the news reaction. And we were expecting, based on the price action, we were expecting possibility of reversal. Price did, but we could not manage to squeeze some good pips. But at least few something is better than nothing. We had a, only a few pips on pound Swiss franc. Uh, pound yen pretty straightforward. Uh, after the news, the price developed another pattern, as you can see it. Based on that, we had this one breakout. And as always, we mentioned 
uh, through live RD commentary to pull back. As you can see, this is a pretty straightforward. You can see the price broke on the previous high and developed a pullback, which is pretty straightforward. That's why this price momentum chart helped us to identify, uh, you know, more high probability trades. As you can see, we had a two beautiful long trade on pound yen and dollar CAD. Pretty straightforward breakout short trade and nicely hit to the first target. Euro yen, pretty straightforward as you can see. Uh, as mentioned on the analysis today, that this level previously priced respected many times. And we also described this level in a four hour chart as soon as the price broken. And we also mentioned to our traders as long as the momentum is bullish, price is above orange EMA we have a valid technical reason even a four hour nice breakout as said any pullback or breakout would be considered high probability uh, of trade so we can see we had a one breakout we mentioned this one and this one and this one we as the price progress we also communicate through live id commentary explaining all these trades so anybody who missed this one can join here or can join here can head join so you can see beautiful four positions uh performed uh, based on this analysis on euro yen aussie dollar pretty straightforward this was the pullback beautiful short trade and kiwi dollar pretty straightforward breakout very small short trade uh dollar cad pretty straightforward you can see here and uh, the price developed i said okay possibility of reversal but as mentioned through live rd commentary the momentum is still bearish so safer stay would be the breakout of this triangle pattern as you can see beautiful short trade on dollar cad euro yen we had uh, this beautiful journey and after that at the new york session we mentioned look for another pullback at this level as you can see exactly the price nicely develop a pullback based on the momentum uh yen was hitting to the wall today we can see uh, all the pairs against the yen was doing perfectly fine so we took a that trade and bank some profit this is, was our final target beautiful another pips on euro yen today pound yen pretty straightforward triangle pattern breakout long trade pound dollar such a beautiful pattern as you can see i also took that trade and beautiful you can see as mentioned on the analysis price nicely develop a pullback and breakout as I always mentioned based on the momentum look for the pullback as you can see, we have one and two pullback. We also basically uh, mention this trade for the this breakout uh, into the four hour, uh, which is uh, I'm going to show you guys just a minute to just to let you know how we analyze the market. If you look at the four hour, we mentioned guys if the price can break uh, this support, which price nicely did. And we said, okay, guys, then we should be taking a pullbacks. And that's what we did. Okay, guys. So, right. So this is in, interesting. As you can see, we had a one breakout, two beautiful pullback short trades. Nicely uh, juicy pips on pound dollar today. Pound Swiss franc, pretty straightforward breakout. And after the breakout, we had a pullback. As you can see, price nicely developed one pullback and second pullback. Two beautiful pullback short trade on pound Swiss franc. Euro pound, pretty straightforward. As mentioned on the analysis, the momentum is developing a bullish. So we should be looking at breakout. And after the breakout, we also had a pullback. Two beautiful long trade on Euro pound. All right, guys, that's it for today. And if you want to watch live intraday analysis in real time, most welcome to join my fast growing trader community at ashrafnoor.com. And don't forget to subscribe my channel for the latest analysis. Thank you for watching this video and I'll see you next time with more analysis.